It's gross outside right now. It's wet. It's chilly. We are going to see lower rain chances as we head through the rest of the day, but it's raining across much of central North Carolina right now, including some heavier downpours right in Wake County, up into Durham County, and then eastern Chatham County as well. Starting to taper off a little bit as you look towards Chapel Hill, Carborough, southern Orange County. All this is moving off to the east. It is not going to rain at this rate for the entire day. But it doesn't stop it from being wet out there right now. So allow some extra time, yes, even before 5 o'clock in the morning for those wet roads this morning. Going to slow you down a little bit. And even if you're not seeing any rain on your neighborhood on the radar, there's still some mist and drizzle to kind of dampen things as well. That heaviest rain is going to push off to the east as we head through the morning. So by noon, we're down to just a few spotty showers left over. Plenty of gray on the satellite simulation. The cloud cover, we're not going to be able to shake that as we head through the day. And a few showers are going to be possible at any point this afternoon as well. So even once the heaviest rain moves off to the the east. Keep the umbrella handy because you could need it still even as we head into this evening. That rain tapers off overnight. We'll start off tomorrow morning with a different problem. Some locally dense fog could slow down Tuesday morning's commute. There's that mist drizzle, just plain old rainfall right now. A few drops on the camera lens as we look towards downtown Raleigh with chilly temperatures, but not cold enough. We have to worry about any frozen precipitation. We are around 40 degrees at worst. Upper 30s in Henderson and in Roxborough, also 39 degrees in Lewisburg, otherwise low to mid 40s. So just plain old chilly rainfall being caused by warmer air trying to move in from the south. It's not going to impact us a whole lot yet today. Temperatures are going to be slow to warm up, to say the least. Still 40s at 8 o'clock this morning. Upper 40s by noon. Skies will brighten a bit as we head into the afternoon, but not much. 54 degrees for that temperature at 3 o'clock. I think we'll briefly warm up into the upper half of the 50s, just barely during the late afternoon hours and then still mid 50s this evening. We don't drop much overnight. Temperatures are going to st steady out in the 50s during the nighttime hours. You're going to be much warmer this afternoon already as you look farther to the south. Again, the warm air coming up from that direction, which is kind of trapping some of the cold air up against the hills in the Piedmont, so you're going to be substantially cooler there. Low to mid 60s as we look towards the southern half of the coastal plain, but then only mid to upper 50s farther north, mid 50s around the triangle, low 50s as you head farther into the Piedmont with those spotty showers still possible during the afternoon. After this, near record warmth settles in for the rest of the week. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, a break from the near record warm Friday, but then back to near record high temperatures Saturday and Sunday. I think we're going to at least tie or break the record highs tomorrow, Wednesday, and Thursday. And we'll be within a shouting distance as we head into the weekend. So we'll keep you updated on that as we go through the rest of the week. The warm air does contain a little moisture, so there's at least a chance of showers every day. Not much to worry about tomorrow or Wednesday. Slightly better chance north of the triangle on Thursday and the weekend. That wouldn't be a weekend around here without at least some chance of rain. So we'll keep you updated on that as the weekend gets closer. Aaron.